guys, today's video is just going to be a really, really quick, like, an easy recipe video meal thingy. Um, usually, I don't have time to, like, do, like, a little gourmet lunch meal or whatever if I haven't meal prepped. And this week, I haven't meal prepped. Um, and I just need something quick and easy to make, like, before I run out the door to go to work. And so, I'm going to be showing you guys what I am putting together. It's really quick. It's really easy. I use um, lean ground turkey for this recipe um, and broccoli, and that's literally all. Um, and the meal is super filling and it's super quick like I make it really really fast so stay tuned for this video if you want to see what I make and how quick and easy it is and it's literally like if you can't cook you can still make this like you know you know you know okay so let's get into the video so for this meal I'm going to be using lean turkey burger patties um, and so this is the brand that I'm using um, I don't really care about the brand I just pick up whichever turkey burgers I see at the store first so this is what I saw first and it's lean um, ground turkey and then you're going to need broccoli and you could actually use whatever kind of vegetable you want but I prefer broccoli because it's usually easier to cook um, and I just like it more it's super filling so I'm using broccoli but you can technically use any vegetable that you want so I just put my turkey burgers into a skillet like that and I just let them cook that way so I'll put them in the skillet like this and then once they're all cooked I will show you guys what I do after they cook in the pan like so my burgers are starting to cook and you want to make sure that you flip your burgers of course over um, because they're definitely going to need to be flipped um, so yeah you can season your patties if they didn't come seasoned but because mine came seasoned I'm not seasoning them any further and I would suggest kind of keeping the salt that you use to a minimum and maybe try to use Mrs. Dash, which doesn't have any salt in the um, mixture. Salt actually helps you retain water weight um, and it just makes you bloated. So you kind of want to stay away from things with too much salt if you want to kind of flatten out your stomach and kind of tone up. So as you can see, I have flipped my turkey burgers because they were finished cooking on one side. So now I'm going to be cooking my broccoli while my turkey burgers finish cooking, so that's what I'm going to be doing right now. So now that my turkey burgers are basically done, I like to add cheese to them um, because I like cheese. So I got some cheese from the deli that's closest to my house and I'm just going to be putting the cheese over top of the turkey burger like so. And then so it melts really nice, I'm going to be putting the lid on top of it and letting the steam kind of melt the cheese. So now that the cheese has melted on my patties, I am just going to be taking them out of the pan. My broccoli has now finished cooking and I'm just going to plate it with my turkey burger. Typically when I make this, I only eat one turkey burger, but for the sake of this video, I put two. You can put, you can eat two if you want to, but like I said, I typically only usually eat one because I get pretty full quickly. Um, and so yeah, this is my quick and easy. I put a little bit of Mrs. Dash on my broccoli to give it some flavor without the salt. You can put anything that you want on your broccoli. Um, but like I said, just keep in mind about the salt content. So if you're like me and you don't like to have the same meal constantly, you can use your other two turkey patties to make a turkey burger like this. And you could basically put whatever kind of condiments on it that you usually get with a hamburger or cheeseburger, but just without the bread. So you use romaine lettuce, and I have one slice of romaine lettuce already underneath my turkey patty. So you can put whatever you want on it. You can put tomatoes, onions, whatever. And after you're done putting on your condiments and stuff like that on your burger, you just take another little slice of romaine lettuce like the one that you you have underneath and you put it on top now because I don't like really anything on my burgers except meat and cheese my little burger looks a little wimpy but if you totally put tomatoes and onions and stuff your burger will look a lot more like an actual burger um, but yeah this is how I like mine so yeah that's like a little bonus meal that you can make with your turkey patty and I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to, don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you'd like to see more videos like this and subscribe if you're not subscribed already and I'll talk to you guys later bye